Ukrainian troops and pro-Russian separatists were locked in fierce fighting in the east of Ukraine on Thursday, after rebels rejected a call to lay down their arms in line with a peace plan proposed by President Petro Poroshenko. Heavy fighting broke out at around 4 a.m. close to Krasny Liman, a town that has been under government control since earlier this month. Men carried armfuls of weapons in nearby Seversk, where an armoured personnel carrier rolled down the street. Poroshenko, installed as president on June the 7th, is pushing a peace plan to end the separatist rebellion, including an offer of unilateral ceasefire by government forces and amnesty for separatists as long as they put down their weapons. Poroshenko was due later on Thursday to meet regional officials from the Donetsk and Luhansk areas of eastern Ukraine to explain his plan, though he rules out meeting separatists. The violence has cost the lives of 147 Ukrainian soldiers and wounded 267 up to now. But many scores of separatist militia, civilians and members of other military bodies such as the National Guard have also been killed and the overall death toll is much higher. Up to 4,000 separatist fighters could be involved in Thursday's fighting near Krasny Liman and armoured vehicles and possibly tanks were being used by both sides.